सो हाई डियर स्कॉर्पियो वेरी वेरी गुड आफ्टरनून टू यू गाइस दिस इज अंजलि टैरोन दिस इज अ जनरल ऑफ रीडिंग फॉर ऑल द स्कॉर्पियो सन मून मिनस राइजिंग कीप इन माइंड दिस इज जनरल इट माइट और माइट नॉट रेजोनेट विद यू द फर्स्ट प्लेस द सेकंड थिंग द रोल्स कैन बी रिवर्स एनी टाइम थर्ड थिंग दिस इज अ रीडिंग फॉर नेक्स्ट सेवेंटी टू आवर्स लेट स्टार्ट योर पार्टनर्स करंट फीलिंग्स फॉर यू राइट नाउ आर लेट सी योर पार्टनर्स करंट फीलिंग्स फॉर यू राइट नाउ आर वर्स एपनिंग लेट सी the chariot the two of pentacles and the king of pentacles and the four of cups somebody is quite confused about the situation right now and somebody is kind of stuck on you they're like i am stuck on this scorpio i am not able to move on what should i do about this they have options they got options but this person is completely stuck on you and they are not able to move on see what is happening here they are trying to move on they are trying to move on from the situation but they are constantly juggling whether they should move on whether they should stay whether they should move on whether they should stay so this person is constantly in conflict constantly fighting with their mind within themselves within their energy it's like i should move on from this scorpio because things are not working out wait i should wait and make things work out i should be stable enough to make things stable in this connection so it's like nothing is making sense for them right now okay like it's not making sense to me right now so scorpio your person uh, he uh, he or she could be a taurus virgo capricorn or a cancer uh yeah cancer pisces scorpio see uh this person is kind of from a very long time this person is trying to move on from you or this person is trying to move on from a particular situation within this relationship but no matter how hard they are trying they are like constantly back and forth energy they are constantly like yeah i'm moving on and then no i'm stable minded i'm going to stay now i'm moving on i'm stable minded i'm going to stay so they're constantly constantly juggling but the truth is that you are the one who is tattooed on your, on their heart or on their mind no matter how hard they're trying to let this go no not able to let this go and it's not like they don't have, have any option or anything it's like they're stuck on you completely and even though they have options they are not able to you know look at those options or enjoy the enjoy the other options that they have it's tricky let's see what you feel for this person your feelings for that person right now currently wheel of fortune 10 of wands and the star okay and empress you're just trying to stay in your power empress you're trying to stay in your power you are like i'm powerful I got all the things of the universe to look beautiful, to do my own stuff, and to uh, expand my business, expand my job career, expand my overall energy, my aura. So it's like a very beautiful energy for you that you are carrying, and you are living. You are just surrendering to the universe. You are like, I'm going to surrender. I can't do anything about the situation, so I'm just going to surrender, and I just want to drop the weight. You know, you are feeling a weight on your shoulders, on your chest. You are like, this is a very burdensome situation, okay? And you just want to let this go. and i feel like you just want to heal see the thing is scorpio that you also feel a soul tie a soul connection with this person you are like okay no matter how burdensome the situation is right now no matter uh, even if this connection is going forward or getting backward or whatever is happening you are still hopeful that everything is going to be fine this connection is going to be healed this burdensome situation is going to be healed okay and slowly but surely things are going to fall into place so you are being very very patient with this person within this whole relationship dynamic you are like i'm going to be very patient with these things uh and your partner on the other hand is very very impatient and they're like juggling and uh, uh, one day they are breaking up with you and the other day they are coming back and hugging you the other day they are breaking up it's like constant battle that they are going through you on the other hand is very patient and very calm and you are like everything is going to be fine and because you can't do anything about the situation so you are you are ex, ex, you are you're just accepting the situation as it is and you are just trying to heal it i feel individually not individually actually you are the one who is trying to heal yourself and you are the one who is giving this energy of healing to the other person as well like might be unconsciously but you are sending healing to them as well so that will the relationship can go in a good direction hmm let's see what's coming towards you till the next 72 hours let's see high priestess the fool and the hermit ace of swords some kind of mental mental clarity is coming i don't see physically you guys are going to meet or talk to each other like uh, very much 
but some kind of mental clarity is coming i feel some kind of divine interference will be there and this connection is going to be pushed to get started again and from scratch level and i do see you guys will be thinking that you guys should give this connection a second chance and uh, both of you because uh, this is mutual energy i do see that both of you are going to think about this connection to think about that things are going to move forward uh, only when we are ready to start it from the scratch level start start it from the friendship level so i feel both of you are going to take a leap of faith with each other and um, energetically you guys are going to start this physically in the 3d world might be you guys are not going to talk to each other about the start uh that let's start from the scratch level let's start from the friendship level kind of thing no but uh, from this from this energetic level you are like yeah let's start it let's do it okay and both of you are going to feel it and both of you are going to start it unconsciously without like talking about it it's like this it's difficult to explain but i hope you are understanding my point So you could be dealing with a Virgo, Aquarius, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, and uh, I'm getting another sign as Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. Yeah, these are the signs that you could be dealing with, or Cancer. So thank you so much for tuning in. I'll see you soon in the next video. Bye bye. Take care. God bless you. Namaste.